We are the keepers of the flame, the sacred order. Let the ceremony begin. On today, Faithful Acolytes, we take a look at this. And what this is, is Fuegos Calaveras. And of course that essentially means fireheads. So, uh, it's mainly hot corn chips. These, I believe, are basically their stab at Takis. I think, because they don't feel like regular corn chips, but we'll find out here shortly. Ingredient wise, we have corn, masa flour, canola oil, garlic, onion, chipotle pepper, lime, smoked paprika, cumin, romano, and parmesan cheese, dehydrated habanero, scotch bonnet, and ghost peppers. So, it probably will be hotter than Takis, which I actually don't think are all that hot. I don't know that it's going to be, shouldn't be at the level of like the crazy crazy reaper stuff but I mean they, they're nice the Takis of course are short for taquitos this infamous barrel shape and they, they smell they smell pretty good they smell like Takis they don't smell overly lime so I'm kind of excited to try this out here let's just go for it Very dusty. Alright, so this is a problem. One of these things. One. And it was already... I just, I just don't like... I don't, I don't like stainy snacks. Oh, there's a... There's a back current to eat there. That's nice. Uh, these aren't super limey. I, I appreciate that. These definitely have been rolled in seasoning a lot though. <coughs> a little dusty. I think really what it is is that these have a lime undercurrent and lime is not the focus. That I think is the hugest difference. I kind of wish lime wasn't there at all, but. These are definitely hotter than any of the Takis I've had. There's a really nice build to this. Flavor-wise, it's a decent approximation. You can get the, a little bit of the cumin. Kind of a vague chili taste to it. I'm not getting any specific pepper. The very strong upfront flavors are just more like a probably closer to taco seasoning. Definitely a little bit of chipotle. Almost uh I don't see our bowl in here, but a little bit of that aspect also. If there's cheeses, I'm not sure what those are for to help stick to it, I guess. These are actually pretty good.
That was always a big problem with Takis is the line. So overpowering. I'm a little interested why they went with Scotch Bonnet and Habanero and Ghost. Little dashes of garlic and onion flavoring there. Definitely powdered. Pretty solid burn. I'd say it's probably a two. So dusty. Yeah, <clears throat> I would give these a two. Of seasoning in here though. Holy moly. A little shade of paprika there. It's a really interesting back of the mouth burn. Yeah, these are nice. I like these. These are uh, one of the more solid snacks from uh, Inferno. Definitely better than anything Takis has had. Maybe their their Halloween ones last year, which you can see. Uh, in the everything else playlist. There's a barbecue and nacho, those were actually pretty good. But regular Takis, these are definitely better. And yeah, I mean these are a good solid too. I probably would get more if I tried to finish these. Having said that I don't like the flavor well enough to get them again, but as far as a really amped up version of Takis that actually is a great flavor, definitely right there. So there you have it. The Inferno Candy Company Fuegos Calabas. Now go forth in peace to serve the flame.